I'm struggling to stay awake. Mm. This is crazy. Holy sh Okay guys, so I just finished my patient encounter and my oral presentation. The encounter went well. It is difficult to navigate our online articulate module for our physical exam, but afterwards we had our oral presentations and we do this pretty much each time we do our patient encounters now where we present the case to an attending. And this basically prepares us for our rotations and for residency even because you will go see a patient, do all the exams, figure out what's going on, and you'll have a working diagnosis and differential diagnosis and you have to present that case to the attending. So each time you, we get someone different for the oral presentation and they just have you know different personality traits and different things that they want. When I was in the Zoom and I was being sent to the breakout room with this particular individual, my heart dropped. Their success and hard work and all of that stuff, their work ethic is really intimidating and admirable, but I was like, oh, oh my God, I am so scared. I ended up doing well and although I got grilled, it was fine because it was such a learning moment. I really like the feedback, uh, the way that they give it, because it is not, don't do this, don't do that. They ask you, why did you say this? Why did you do this dosage? Why did you do this? They're asking you so you can critically think. And I was stumped a few times when the question, questions that I was being asked, just because I was like, oh, I don't know, like what is my thought process? And so being asked that, it really helps you do better each time. I'm gonna shower and like restart the day over again because these encounters just throw me off. It's all good. All right, talk to you guys in a bit. Hello, you guys, what is up? It's currently 1.15 and I'm dressed, showered, ready for the day. Even though I really don't feel like studying, I am trying my best to get through Anki cards right now. I just want this week to be over. That's what we're doing right now. I'm on my second cup of coffee. I had a Red Bull last night and I posted that on my Instagram story and I was like, don't drink this. And I regret drinking it because I didn't really sleep at all last night. I was tossing and turning and also just stressed and I don't know. So I'm drinking coffee, second cup. I'm going to keep working on Anki and we will chat a little later. I'm struggling to stay awake. Hey guys, what's up? It is Tuesday, December 8th. I really have not vlogged at all today other than just me studying all day. I'm exhausted. I'm so tired. It's currently 4.30. Probably won't talk to you much today because I'm just trying to stay awake and finish this stuff. All right, I'm gonna keep studying and I'll talk to you guys later, tomorrow. I don't know, we'll see you in the next clip. It is currently Wednesday, December 9th, and it's 12.22. I have been strapping down, figuring out what I don't know, and I've been learning it, and I am so saturated. But also, I still don't feel ready, but also, I'm just fearful for how I felt last week. I just don't want that to happen again. Uh, yeah, I've been studying. I finished my Anki. I'm just doing, like, last-minute review stuff, because I've been through the lectures a hundred times, I feel like, so... I made some last minute notes. So for the farm lectures that we had this block, I had trouble with them just because a lot of the information presented in the lecture was not included on Sketchy and just because it was like all encompassing of the drugs and Sketchy's kind of like the high yield stuff. Took pages out of my notebook and I made kind of just like high yield, I guess, sheets of it. Like the red is the side effect. I don't know. This is how I did it. So yes, once tomorrow's over, we will resume normal content that isn't so bland hi hey guys what's up i changed into comfy clothes because i just want to be comfy and i'm tired and i also took like a 20 minute nap i'm just studying away procrastinating at the same time
Hi guys, what's up? It's currently whoa, still Wednesday. Obviously, it's 10:45 in the morning. It's it's not 10:45 in the morning. <laughs> All right, it's 10:45 in the evening. I have been studying, kind of like leisurely reading my Pathoma textbook, still trying to hammer through these notes, but I'm kind of going to call it here soon just because I'm saturated. Um, at this point, I can say that I have busted my butt over the last week and I have done all that I can do to s prepare for this exam. So I know a lot more than I did last whatever Friday. I'm just going to accept what I know, accept what I don't know, and then we'll just go into the exam with confidence and be ready for the challenge. Okay, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay, bye. Good morning guys it is currently thursday it's 8 15 and i'm waiting to get into the room for the exam they're almost ready so my setup i've got my computer my whiteboard earplugs and that's all i'm ready to get this over with so i'll talk to you guys after because i need to focus okay you guys i'm done i'm gonna listen to sean mendez to celebrate um the exam was like fair, kind of confusing a little bit, but I feel relieved. Kind of worried. I wonder what my score is going to be, but I guess we'll find out later. You guys, I have to pay for my Comlex exam now. It's so crazy. Over these two exams, I will be paying over $1,000 to take the biggest exams of my academic career. <gasps> there goes my credit card and debt. Uh, okay. Do I have to find a date now? Mm -hmm. Oh my lanta. This is crazy. I think I'm taking my step one and my complex in June. Let me just do this really quick and think. So I just had like the most massive anxiety attack after scheduling that exam. I just remember my buddies going through it last year and it just didn't look like fun. I'm not excited to study like that. <laughs> it is what it is. Yep. I'm gonna talk to you guys in a little bit once I chill out. Yeah, yeah. Good morning guys, it is Friday, December 11th, and it's 11, almost 30 in the morning. I'm waiting to do the premiere with you guys. Sorry I didn't finish vlogging yesterday. Um, I was upset, and then I ended up looking at my scores for my final, because they came out. I did okay, actually. I'm shocked, but also, you know, I worked hard, I did the best that I could, and um, I'm not mad about my score, but also I know I could have done better. Hi guys, what's up? So I just finished getting ready. I know I've been wearing this sweatshirt for like three days in a row, but it's totally fine. Um, I am going to head to the post office and gonna also go to my dentist because I need to grab my Invisalign trays. If you didn't know, I do Invisalign and I have a few trays left. And then yeah, post office because I'm getting a PO box. I'm so excited. So uh, yeah, let's uh, do that. Hi guys, what's up? So this is a new angle. You're actually on Alexa and a candle. I got bum 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 my PO box. Yes, we have a PO box. I will put everything here and down below in the description box if you ever need to find it. Uh, you can send me stuff if you want. I don't know. It'd be really cool to do PO box unboxings, which would be fun. No one's around. 
Hey guys, I left my house and I'm on a hike with this human. Who's that? Want to jump? <laughs> no. Just a little rest stop and then we're going up. Oh. That's the path right there. I need a helicopter. Holy shit. How are we going to get down? Same way. You want to tell people about what's coming next semester for you? What's coming next semester? You're like six months away from your step. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous, but I came to accept that I just have to work hard, you know? Like I passed, so you're going to be fine. Yeah, Arcadi passed, so I can <laughs> pass. <laughs> I just, I'm not going to move that date at all, so like it's just set in stone, and now I just have to bust my butt. Medical school is like climbing a mountain. Sometimes you want to get up, get, I mean, get, get up give up and it's windy and cold and then you just have to keep going because you can kind of see the end but not really and then you think it's the end but it's not actually the end and then you just keep going Rachel what I made, made it Guys, we made it down. Yeah, solid two hours. You want to give up like 10,000 times, but you keep going until you bop, bop, bop to the top. Whoa! <laughs> I mean, the food. Are we having a what's it called? Mukbang. What's that called? Mukbang. Mukbang. mukbang? I'm what is say that? It wrong? Chata. Tastes like a churro. The house taco. I feel like astronauts when they want to have churro, that's what they have. <laughs> pop it on it. Nope. On the curb? Mm. Was it open? No. Mmm. Mmm. Your body's like it. Mm. 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 I'm not eating today. Mmm. You can live in this, right? I can live in this. That's what I say when things are really tasty. I'm like, oh, I can live in it. I would live in that taco. Wrap myself up. Your body's it's like, like an ocean. ocean. Dang it. I got a chive in my seatbelt hole. <laughs> I'll get it out. Genius. Your body's like, like an, an ocean. ocean. The song for my outro. Mm -hmm. How's it go? Cue the song. He wrote that. Like sitting and hanging out. He's like, pick up the car and turn. I'll make it out of one piece. Or maybe two.